Hi, my name is Richard Finn. I'm an emergency trauma physician assistant at a busy local ER in Southern California. In my line of work, I see a lot of major injuries from car accidents, and we're here to tell you about a product that we've developed that can save a lot of moms with babies in utero. My name is Pete Calderon. I'm from Mission Viejo, California. I am currently a volunteer ski patrol director for Mountain High Ski Patrol in the city of Wrightwood, California. I am also on a federal disaster team here in California and I am by trade a truck driver. Did you know that over 6 million women in just the United States alone become pregnant every year? Out of those 6 million women, 60,000 of those uh, will be involved in a motor vehicle accident. Out of those 60,000, one in every hundred fetuses will die. That amounts to one fetus a day dying as a result of a low speed car accident. Coming up with this design, I happened to come across a seamstress that when she took a look at this design, she immediately knew what it was. And then she started crying. I was kind of dumbfounded about this. What was, what was wrong with this? Well, she told me that she would certainly help me to sew this and come up with this product. But she said that she wished this could have been invented 10 years ago. Little did I know that she lost her child 10 years ago from a low speed impact to a wall that the lap belt snapped the fetus's neck, ultimately killing the fetus. Now that we have our final prototype, I have spoken and actually gone to a crash test facility in Atlanta, California. There are four of them in the United States. One of them happens to be here in California. It's a great facility. We're in talks with them. They need those data from the uh, static pull test first. Once that is completed, then we can go to them and they can set up a crash test dummy for us. The initial setup for one of these crash tests is about $15,000. You're going to get high definition, resolution, slow motion cameras. You're going to use your facilities. You're going to use your dummies. You're going to use the electronic components. It's going to take about half a day for them to set everything up. After that, we don't, we're going to need some sled tests. And each test after the initial test is going to be about $6,000. We're going to need a front end, impact, side, and rear. And we want to do a couple more just for safety purposes. Once we have all those tests done, then we can bring it to the market. 